Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Other than, obviously, go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Well, I'm up for pretty much whatever, so... Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime. In her case, later than sooner. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth, whoever All truth, right, let's uh, just get on with it. Okay, so, first, we're gonna- I'll start. Run. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait! I want to hear- Oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm-hmm. like- Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods, now no. just face it. I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's- I just like her as a friend. That's- that's all. She's cool. All right. Great, let's just move on. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! Anything more interesting than that? I think we'll be too involved in our own fun to come get you. Well, wouldn't you know it? That's just fine by me. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. No, no, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Alex, you wanna check out the caves, or...? Uh, in a sec, okay? Yeah, just let me know. (laughs) Oh, oh, I forgot. We never talked about John. Oh, what, their date? Yeah, he, uh... They went to that weird carnival. (laughs) How'd he even get Jenny out of the house? (laughs) I don't know. Thanks for making the fire. Yeah, sure. Gotta put those owl scout lessons to use. Look, Nona. Now that we're not playing that stupid game, what do you really think about Ren? Uh, what do you mean? You know, just in general, I guess. He's neat, I guess. Sometimes he acts a little weird, but weird is good. It's better than normal. Look, Alex, Ren seems nice, and I know he's your friend and, you know, whatever, but I'm just not in the mood for something right now. Um, so if you could just, like, tell him that just so he like doesn't get his hopes up or whatever just think about it will you he's not a bad guy i know but you think about it too yeah sure thing thanks you look relaxed i am relaxed clarissa seriously what's your problem nothing's wrong alex and even if something was wrong Let's hop this thing and check in with Ren. All right, let's do it. Come on, I'll push you over. Whenever you're ready. So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of one to ten, how weird's it gonna be? Hmm, probably a five. Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. (laughs) All right. Hey. Chris seems to be her normal, annoying self. Sorry about that. Eh, it's not your fault. I think somebody dumped pig's blood on her in a previous life, and now she just wants to get ahead of the curve. <laughs> yeah, probably. Thanks for, uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the, uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but 
you know, you could have and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah, Ren, about Nona. What? Did she say anything? Because if she said anything, you should tell me. Like, what? I think you should go for it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I mean, you only live once, so... Oh, all right. I see where your head's at. Now, who's ready to have their minds... Hey! Hey! I... I saw you guys coming up from the tower. The Dick Tower. Yes. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great. This is perfect. I know exactly what to do. Do you? Yeah, totally. It's Maggie Adler. Maggie Adler? Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. I mean... Her house, manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know, but the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. My sister, Allie, worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, 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 we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a burnout. Okay, so I ate like two brown... Well, and I'm not saying it's the best plan, but what other plan is there really, Jonas? Oh, I don't know. Fix the radio, find Clarissa, set fire to the mug shop. And these are just off the top of my head. Yeah, I'm still worried about Clarissa. But we don't know where Clarissa is. I'm not saying literally do that. I'm just... <laughs> There's other things we can do. <laughs> but there isn't. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. Uh, oh, shut up, everybody. Look, here's something cool, a phone. Let's stop making Alex uncomfortable and talk about this instead. Look, Jonas... It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Alex knows she can trust me. Ren, it's okay. Relax. I like the plan. The plan's fine, Willow. It doesn't matter if the plan is fine. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. I know you said Ren is like harmless or whatever, but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is my best friend. Yeah, and she could hardly- Guys, stop it. Stop. The collective neuroses call a truce, okay? Yes, please. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, yeah, not... it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever, I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You... Ah, uh, stop it! Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night... Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller, who do you want coming with you? Jonas, let's go. Ah, <sighs> thank you. What? First you ditched me back in town to talk to this guy about God knows what, and now that stuff's gone crazy, you're still picking him over me? Him? Him. Him? Ren, come on. It'll be fine. We'll watch the walkie-talkie. Ren, we're still, we're still doing your whole plan you came up with. Who cares if you're on the home or the away team? I want to be on the Alex team. I want to. Jesus, that house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Ad. Ah, oh, she does have a boat. Yeah. See, Allie knew what she was talking about. She should, anyway. I mean, she had to schlep back and forth here all summer. There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's, like, a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. And here's a combination for a padlock to a... chest is all it says. 29, 18, 54. A chest? Have you seen one yet? 
Let's just look. It'll probably... Finally. Carissa, oh, God, Jesus. you scared me. Thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. How do you get in here? The door was locked. Do you have, like, a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Kitchen window? Where? In the back. In the kitchen. I don't believe you. These windows don't even... They don't work like that. How would you know you've never been here? Look, Clarissa's here, so everyone's here now. We can just... Everyone's okay, all right? That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just... Find the keys to the boat, or a phone, or whatever, and just find a way home. I promise. We can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Yeah, fine. Okay, let's focus up. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. How are you doing? How are you doing? You know what? Better than friggin' ever. I feel like I've never stopped winning since we landed. I think you're a liar, but... It's good to hear for some reason, anyway. Uh, Put some clothes on! <laughs> Remember that guy? Where are your parents? Your kid's better than- Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy was a friggin' weirdo. Uh, yeah. Hey, Nona. Hey. Uh, so this is a really awkward time to bring this up, but everything's terrible now, so why not? Have you thought about Ren? Like, at all? <laughs> Surprisingly? Uh, a little. Oh my god, you're like those sailors who dreamed of banging a walrus. Shut up! But you can, you can forget what I said about telling him I'm not interested, if that matters at all. I don't know why I said that to begin with. So, are you interested now, by chance? <laughs> yeah, right. No, no, I just... I'm gonna try and not close off things before I even know what I'm closing off, I guess. So, just never mind with all that. Find anything useful? Not yet. But you know, the night is young. How's the, um... Nona stuff going. What do you care? Like, seriously, why didn't you let me go with you to Main Street? Did I do something that bad? All right, Ren, honestly, the time has come to let it go. I mean, this just can't be a big deal compared to everything else tonight. Then I'm... I, 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 don't, I don't know. I'm just sore about it still, but whatever. I'll chew my resentment down till we're out. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. <sighs> God, we're in another loop de loo They always come at the most appropriate. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... He died. I couldn't... Oh my God, Ren. I, I can't believe this. What happened? He... he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... he just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And... Ren, whatever you want to call it, I know you're doing it. Just fix it! It's not us doing it, dear. We weren't lying. The time loops, as you've taken to calling them, which we do find so adorable, are of your own making. Whatever. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. And you... What on earth would give you the idea that I'm in charge? It's been like herding puppies the entire night, making anyone do anything. Please drop the modesty. It's lying for no reason. It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss, we won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. 
No, no, no way. I'm saving everyone. Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Hmm? <sighs> Fine. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all with the rules. I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just gone. It's okay, Nona. You, you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. No, no, come on. We can still crack this. I do not believe... I, I won't that he's gone forever. I, I just won't. I wish I had your faith in things. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. He knew, Nona. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. But thanks, Alex. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period. Like, buying a used car that I can already tell is missing a lot. Say anything about what? What are you guys talking about? We're dating! We're dating! Nona and I, we're gonna date! Rin! Dude! What did I just say? What? They asked! Right? You asked? Mazel tov on the happy couple! <laughs> Thank you! No. Stop. It's one date. At the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Romantic. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the other. Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one. One good thing forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually. Though they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. Clarissa fled to the East Coast, dropped out of college, and works at a boutique. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. It's funny. What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's, I don't know, it's good, I think. But anyways, I, um, well, I'm taking some time off just to, I don't know, readjust my priorities, figure out what I want to do. But anyways, what time is it? Yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. 
Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing, and I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. Ugh, I hope he's not weird, or mean, or something. Whatever, I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right?